Good morning, it's Annette Priest Judd. Got a new listing for you. This listing's um, actually listed with Gary Turnbull in our office, and Gary's contact information is 801 597 1842. So contact Gary to get more information about this property. It's in an area in Kaysville called Hess Farms. It's in the um, Stony Brook development of Hess Farms, and it's located at 1305 South, 150 East. And it's just located, if you're familiar with the Kaysville area, Fruit Heights area near um, Davis High School, Cherry Hill Parking and um, Water Park and Campgrounds. Um, the Oak Ridge Country Club is nearby, Golf Course and Country Club is nearby. So we're gonna take a look at this property and hopefully you'll give us a call. So this property is listed at 1305 South, 150 East in Kaysville. It's located near Oak Ridge Country Club and Golf Course and Fruit Heights area where you've got Cherry Hill Campground and Water Park and Davis Golf is a public golf course that's nearby as well and this is located in a cul-de-sac of the development called Hess Farms. Let's take a look inside. It's a faded red brick Rambler home with 1,553 square feet on the main floor and 1,553 square feet downstairs. The basement is unfinished. It has a large line storage room with shelving downstairs. If you check out the pictures that we have, the photos that we have online, you'll be able to see the pictures of the basement area that's unfinished. We have an oak, a honey oak floor and railings and cabinetry in this home. Off to the right, is a step-down formal living room. Could be an office if you wanted to frame in the doorway. Got a bay window. I mean a large window, not a bay window. And then a large formal entry and for, uh, formal foyer. And this hallway takes us down to the bedrooms. Three good-sized bedrooms on the main floor with a linen closet and a pillow and blanket closet right there for keeping track of paper goods and this is another bedroom here and both of these bedrooms have full closets in them large closets if you wanted to put dividers in there to use the space a little differently you could do that lots of daylight coming in good high ceilings six panel doors a good carpet very comfortable it's a newer home shower bath combination and then the master bedroom has two closets his and hers but the closet actually goes the rod all goes all the way through so again if you wanted to put dividers up here to make better use of that closet space organizers and then two bed two bit two big windows in the master bedroom and then the master bath is a three-quarter bathroom with a shower and a single sink vanity. We have a gas fireplace insert here with a white tile. It's a porcelain tile that surrounds the honey oak mantle. Great for putting up Christmas decorations or Easter or any kind of holidays or showing off travel souvenirs. This is the family room area. We've got a great backyard we're going to check out and show you that. It's an odd shaped lot. We'll have copies of the lot plan on the listing. So you can pull that up if you want to. So we got a secretarial cabinetry work area over to the one side and then a huge setup for a fridge. And then there's a breakfast bar eating area, breakfast nook, eating area. Great cabinetry, appliance garage. This is a Formica countertop. And then a gas range, excuse me, an electric range. And then that's access to the two car garage outside that door. And then we have a coat closet and a large pantry area. And a mudroom, laundry room combination off the back, back door. So you got two back doors, one by the breakfast nook, family room area, 
and one here by the laundry area with cabinetry up above. Great big room, great for entertaining, small families or um, empty nesters, it's a good home. Big patio. All fenced. Like I mentioned earlier, there is an irregular shaped yard, but it sure is big. There's lots of room back here. If you've got a young family, want to do trampoline, pay, practice soccer, there's plenty of room back here for yard games. A small garden area. Somebody's got a willow tree there. It's a great yard. Give Gary a call at 801-597-1842. We hope to make this your new home. I'm about two miles away from the property that we have listed at 1305 South, 150 East. I wanted to give you an idea of where this is located. So that's the Bountiful North Salt Lake area that we're looking at along the Wasatch Front. And just around that bend of mountains there on the other side is the Capitol. And the airport's just west of that. And the Oak Ridge Country Club is um, this way, about a mile and a half from here. And then that's the Great Salt Lake with the islands out there. And then this is a hillside community, so our listing is located about a mile and a half that direction. Over on the hilltop, it's in Kaysville. The area we were just looking out over is Farmington. And over this direction is Fruit Heights. So this property is located just to the right in the middle of Davis County area. And there's a major interstate and highway connection highway 89 91 right down over there and then the ferris wheel that you see over there is the lagoon amusement park and water park and then fruit heights is where cherry hill is located just about right that direction on the other side of this mortuary is where cherry hill is located so if you're familiar with some of the things that are around here and in the activities. All of those mountains contain hiking trails, mountain trails, motorcycle trails. Um, so there's all kinds of activities in the winter time. And you're located about 25 to 30 miles, probably closer to 30 miles between um, to Big Cottonwood, Little Cottonwood, Park City, Deer Valley in that direction. And then this direction you've got Snow Basin, Powder Mountain, and about 30 miles that direction, plus the reservoirs and streams and stuff that are around for outdoor water recreation. You're probably about 25 to 30 minutes from about three or four of those. And then if you're into sailing, uh, you got the Great Salt Lake, which is probably about 20 minutes that way out on the causeway, out on the west, out to Antelope Island and the marina out there. So anyway, it's a great property, great location, just giving you an idea of what's around here.